Hello guys, welcome back to another Disney Pixar Cast on Cast Review. Today we'll be reviewing the Demolition Derby racer Patty from Cars 3. You're all probably aware of the theme by now where I'm reviewing cars that I wanted to review for a while but never got around to. Patty is one of them. At for the last couple of reviews, I've been reviewing cars that I got on Christmas of 2018 that I wanted to review. After I review all the cars from Christmas 2018 that I wanted to review, we're going to review cars from 2018 and 2020 that I wanted to review but never got round to. And make sure you stay tuned for that because it's going to be a really fun ride. There's loads of cars. Uh, there's lots of piston cut races from all three generations as well as other cars like Lightning McQueen variants, other background characters like Antonio Valande Excellente, Ramon variants, it's going to be great. So, without further ado, let's get into the view of Patty. So, Patty appeared in Cars 3 and was a background character. She appeared in the Demolition Derby scene and is one of the many racers competing in the Demolition Derby at Thunder Hollow. She, unlike other, other racers, actually got to have a speaking line, that being a scene where her and Bill collided when a lot of cars were being pushed on by... Miss Fritter, and she was like, and Bill was like, oh, hey, Patty, and she was like, oh, hey, Bill, in a Western-like accent. So, Patty did have a speaking line, which is very nice to see, and I really like Patty. She has this really nice grey design. She's not one of my favourite Demolition Derby races and compared to others she does fall flat. I still really like her. Now this is a inaccurate version with the wrong roof and what was really stupid of me is on my birthday in 2019 my so it was my birthday in 2019 and my parents got me the accurate version. And I said, oh, and sometimes it's a common case with my cars collecting, I'll get duplicate cars. And usually what we do is we give them back. Is If I get a duplicate car, I'll, I'll trade it in back to the store for money. And that's what I did with the accurate patty, believing that it was the exact same as the original patty. I didn't realise it, it was the accurate version. So I was this close to getting the accurate version. <laughs> if only I didn't give it up. <sighs> Silly me. Oh well, maybe next time. But her inaccurate version is still really cool too. So without further ado, let's get into the review. As you can see, she's got this nice determined expression with these little buck teeth. And a grey grill. She has this spray paint design like a lot of the Demonstration Derby racers. She's got a bit of rust on her grey hood there as well as a few dents and this flap thing. You've got a lot of dents over here. With 74 and everything. This spray paint design. Fake wooden outlets. On the sides and everything these white tires which are sprayed white on the back it has a rust in piece and some more dents and rust and everything along with this bu her bumper I have this more fake wood thing the side is pretty much the same as the other and the hood has 74 in white, contrasting to the rusty grey. I really do like Patty. She's not one of my favourite um, Demolition Derby racers. 
But I still really like her. And she's still a really cool car. Especially with the rust in peace and everything. That's just... <laughs> Anyway, guys, that'll be all for this video. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Bye now.